Alexander Pishushkin, Moscow, Russia. Known as the chessboard killer and the bits of park maniac, his killing spanned 14 years from 1992 to 2006. Alexander would befriend his victims, mostly homeless men, young men and women to drink vodka with him in Moscow's Bitsa Park. After a few drinks and gaining some trust, he would attack them from behind with a hammer, smashing holes in their skulls. He then would push the same vodka bottle into the skull wound of his victims, which became his calling card. It's also believed he threw some victims down into the sewers that ran beneath Bitsa Park. Once arrested, he had confessed to 63 murders, which was down to 60 after three of his victims survived their ordeal, but he was only convicted of 48 counts of murder, the last being a woman aged 36. Her body was found sometime during spring 2006 with a metro train ticket in her belongings, which led police to review surveillance tape footage where she was filmed hours before her death walking on the train platform with Alexander. He was arrested on June 16, 2006. He claims to have murdered 63 people, one person shy of the 64 that would have made his name the chessboard killer more accurate, being there are 64 squares on a chessboard. He has stated if not arrested, he would have kept killing, so the name the Bitsa Park Maniac would be more accurate. Alexander stated he wanted to become Russia's most prolific serial killer, a title held by Andrei Chikatilo, who was convicted of 53 murders between 1978 till 1990. On the 24th of October 2007, Alexander Pishushkin was sentenced to life in prison, with the first 15 years to be served in solitary confinement. While in prison, he made contact with a woman named Natalia through letters, and she accepted his marriage proposal. They are engaged, yet never actually met in person. As of uploading this video, he is still alive.